I want to start this by saying that the Casa Marina Resort is money for the vibe, the ambiance, the grounds, the beach, and the pool. But I do have a public service announcement for you about the food. Ah yeah, VFC travels on YouTube. Subscribe. I usually don't give bad reviews, food reviews. Everybody's got their ding. Not everybody has a great palate like VFC does. But for the amount of money you spend here, I feel like I gotta say something. Uh, but I've been here a few times to eat now. Everything's been, uh, you know, not really worth the money. But I got chicken adobo. So when I got it from Casa Marina, and you're paying like 60 bucks for a, a dinner dish and a glass of wine. So you're paying like 30 bucks. That's why I feel like I gotta say something about this. Not much flavor. The chicken was, you could tell it was cooked from frozen, which means there's no, no ingredient going on. So the food kind of sucked. And the outside herbs and spices on the skin could barely taste anything. The rice was uh, decent, but again, for $30 a plate, nah, come on. Get your shit together with this one. It's a Hilton property too, so you know, gotta get their shit together a little bit with this one. But if you're gonna spend the amount of money you spend on a plate at Casa Marina, five minute walk away is Louis' backyard. It's high end dining again. You're gonna pay, but you're not gonna get a bad dish in that place. This is disappointing, very sad to say, and I don't do negative reviews except for Papa John's New York style pizza. So you should go watch that video. But I will do a negative review because you spend a lot of money here and your money's gotta go a long way if you're gonna spend that. Louis Backyard, plenty of places in Key West, you pay that kind of money for fine dining and are worth it. Don't spend your money doing that here. Ah uh, yeah, sorry, but BFC's travels on YouTube, Key West, Florida.